Hello everyone, we have a surprise today, a big surprise from Mehoyo themselves, or should I say Hoyoverse? Well, <clears throat> they revealed two characters today, uh, one is, uh, what was her name? Yeah, Kuki, her name is Kuki Shinobu, she's real cute, real cute, and also she's a deputy leader of the Arataki gang that will make her really really interesting character you know I personally loved Ito but I couldn't get him and that's why I'm happy to have someone else of Arataki gang in my uh, party and enough of Cookie there's another character which is the main star of this reaction and is Yelan. Oh my god. This character. She looks like... It looks like that uh, Shinchu got a stepmother. That, that, that's what it looks like. <laughs> or auntie, maybe. Or uh, Shinchu's auntie, maybe. And also, look at her. Just look at her beauty. Oh my god. I'm gonna save my entire... Primos, dude, fuck Ayato, fuck him. Who cares about Ayato when you have this Hydro character? J just, I don't know why. I don't know why Hoyoverse or Mehoyo or whatever you want to call them just want to kill the banners that they release. Like Ayato is a Hydro character, and she's a Hydro character. So why would you release a Hydro character that's a waifu, that is a very cool character visually. Also, I f believe that Yelan is a bow character. I don't know how good of a fighter she will be. That's my only concern because uh, if she's a bow character, I don't know, bow characters are hit or miss a lot of the time so I don't know about that. But because she's a waifu and she has by far the coolest looking model ever made, I will be pulling for her for sure and also what do we know about her yelon valley orchid a mysterious person who claims to work for the ministry of civil affairs so uh nobody is sure whether she is working with civil affairs or no or is she actually some sort of special I don't know, a special agent or something. Yelan's identity has always been a mystery. She often appears in various guises at the center of events. Well, maybe they mean that she's gonna get a lot of outfits, maybe? And disappears before the storm stops. Before the storm stops? Why? Does it mean that she she does not fight when the situations are very sticky and dangerous? Uh, I don't know. And what about the other one? Uh, I'd like to suggest that you treat her as an ordinary person, okay? But if you do, it's easy to lose control over negotiations. Yanfei. Oh, uh, so she's related to Yanfei. Cool. Valley Orchid, a mysterious person who claims her in Arcai, we know that already, Hydro, uh, Umberless Orchis. Alright, let's move on. <laughs> uh, let's move on to Kuki again. Uh, Kuki Shinobu, member of uh, Turbulations, uh, deputy, of, deputy leader of Artaki Gang. Well, alright. There's not... Oh, there's one. I am writing to uh, introduce a talented person to you. Uh, Kujusara. Alright. Also, she is... Kuki is also a baddie waifu, you know? And I think, by the looks of it, that she's a sword user. Right? Oh, yeah. It shows it right here, I think. 
sword user so if we look at her here no there's no sign of a bow here because she's too magnificent to even show us anything but I think that uh, Kuki is a sword character also because of this mostly but she's a cool character she is an extremely cool character I'm gonna pull for her and uh, yeah that, that was it uh, will you guys be pulling for Yelan or no let me know down in the comments and also I think I like the haircut of Xingqiu now. Alright, uh, I see you guys in the next video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this or more Genshin videos. See you guys in the next